In this tutorial, I will explain how to update the program of work. But first, I did something on purpose here so I can show you how it's done. So we started with the first milestone start of foundation. And I just want to add a new milestone. It's called the project start. After the project start, there will be start of foundation. So they will have the same date. It's linked together. So they will have the same date. But because I added the project commencement milestone later, it came below here. But I wanted to make it a top for good presentation, even though they have the same dates. But I want to have the project commencement, the first activity in this WBS. So the best way to do it is to sort by start. So now both dates are coming. And what if we sort by activity ID? It will come at last because I added the project commencement milestone at the end. So let's rename the activity ID into something that can be at top. So if we make the sorting ascending, the project commencement here will come at top. If you go to start again, it will take the second place. So you can right click group and sort sort and you click by start after this condition is met. You have another sorting by activity ID. So now it will come at top. So now we have combined sorting. So first Primavera will sort everything by start. It's top priority. And if more than one activity starts on the same time, they will sort it by activity ID. So I just want to explain it quickly so you will not get confused. So now let's update the program of work. I will take first a copy of the baseline schedule. We will make our first update. This is update and I will run data date one week after the project commencement because now we have the plan to start is 8th of August. So one week after will be 15th of August. Open the project, then I will assign the baseline. So first we maintain it. Click close, go to project. Assign baseline. Okay. And if you go now to, if you decided to restore the baseline, you cannot because the schedule is assigned already. So you cannot. So you have to remove the assignment first before you restore or remove the baseline from the project. So you have to do that first. You go to current project and click OK. Then you will be able to maintain or restore the baseline schedule. We'll assign it. OK, and the project start. Let's OK, we started on time. Let's assume that the start of foundation also with the project commencement. I do not have any update for completion of foundation for excavation. I started on time. And it is 20% complete. So after that, I will run the program F9 or a schedule this simple. And I will apply selected data date to open all projects. So I will run the program after one week, my data date 15th of August, then click schedule. So this is the update I got so far in the project. Let's have a look at the file. So this is all of statistics. So here you have one project you you have run overall activity is 26. None started how many in progress one activity only the excavation activity The completed two because we updated two milestones. So Promavera will recognize that there are two activities that have been completed. Total number of relationships in the schedule is 33. Here we have warnings, uh, start and completion of paint. So I assumed that for this tutorial that the last activity is completion of paint. So this is like project completion or the, the last milestone in the project. And typically you will have at least two activities without relationships, without successor, without predecessor, without successor. So project start typically will not have predecessor. So this is fine, actually, because I have one milestone without predecessor and only one milestone without successor, like a start and finish. And also you want to review the out of sequence. We have zero, but let's take an example. OK, let's say that you did not. You just missed updating the start of foundation. You updated all construction work. 
and you missed updating the start of foundation and you click run you click again and you view the log you view the log after you run the program so you have here out of sequence activities excavation so when you run the program so you have one activity that started before the start of the previous activity so this is an alarm in promovera so it can be something that you missed updating like in our case start of foundation or there is change in the logic from your original plan so say for example you assumed that excavation will be after comp compaction after excavation but but let's take another example like for soft logic for example if you have but these are are all hard logic so it's a mandatory relationships but sometimes you have soft logic maybe the, the actual progress on site will be different from the planned sequence so in this case it will give you an alarm also do you need to make these changes or not because otherwise the outcome of the schedule update will not be realistic so th this is how you review the out of sequence in the program let's give this the same actual back again the correct one okay in the next lecture we will talk about how to review the progress update